this is a very very pretty stitch I changed to the circular ones so I can knit without making so much noise but this is I'm calling it the climbing fern because that's how I see the ferns the leaves so pretty and I'm using the needles that the yarn calls for so this is a number four cotton yarn and I'm using size 9 knitting needles and uh, it is this stitch is a multiple of 16 plus 2 so I have 16 and 16 and then one for each edge so that's 32 plus 2 34 only for this sample okay so row number one what you want to do is pass the first one as if to knit, pass it, and then you're going to knit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then you're going to yarn over, knit one, Yarn over, knit three, one, two, three, and then you're going to slide this one as if to knit, slide the next one as if to knit, then knit the next one, and the two that you slip are going to go over that last knitted one. And that's one repetition. So let's do that again. You are going to knit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You're over knit one. You're over knit three. One, two, three and then slide, slide, knit and the two that you slid are going to go over that last one and then the last one you knit. So that is row number one. Row number two, and this is the wrong side, you are going to slide one all the uh, the even number rows you're going to do the same you slide the first one as if to purl with your yarn in front and then purl the whole row so all the even numbers are the same and I'll finish this row and I'll see you on row number three row number three you are going to slide one as if to knit and then knit 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Now you're going to yarn over, knit 1, yarn over, knit two and then slide slide knit and the two that you slid go over that last one so let's repeat that again you're going to knit ten one two three four five six seven eight, nine, ten, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit two, and then slide, slide, knit, and the two that you slid go over that last one, and then the last stitch you knit. 
and then ro row number four is the same as row number two in which you slide the first one as a to purl and then purl the whole row. Row number five. What we want to do is slide one as if to knit and then we're going to knit three stitches together. So you pick up the three, knit, and take them off. Now you're going to knit four. One, two, three, four. Yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit three. One, two, three. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over, knit one. And slide, slide, knit. And those two go over the last one. And then we're going to repeat that. So we're going to knit three stitches together. And knit four. One, two, three, four. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over, knit three. One, two, three. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over, knit one. And slide, slide knit, put those two over the last one that you knitted and then the last one you knit. And then of course row number six is going to be slip one as if to purl and then purl the whole row. Now see you when I finish this one. Row number seven. What you want to do is slide one as a to knit and then knit these three stitches together and knit three. One, two, three. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over, knit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So let's repeat this. So you're going to knit three stitches together and then knit three. One, two, three. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over, knit nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then the last one, we knit. And then row number eight is the same as all even number rows. You're going to slide on a zip to purl and purl the whole row. Row number nine. We're going to slip one, a zip to knit, and then again we're going to knit these three stitches together. Now we're going to knit two, yarn over, knit one. Yarn over and knit ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. We're going to repeat again. 
So we're going to knit three stitches together. Knit two. Yarn over, knit one. Yarn over and knit ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then the last one we knit. And then of course row number ten is going to be a purl row. We pass one as up to purl and we purl the whole row. Row number 11. So we're going to slip one as up to knit and we're going to knit these three stitches together. Now we knit one yarn over knit one, yarn over, and knit three, one, two, three. Now yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit four, one, two, three, four, and then slip, slip, knit and the ones that you slipped go over that last one. So we're going to repeat this and we're going to knit three stitches together. Knit one, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit three, one, two, three. Yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit four, one, two, three, four, and then slip, slip, knit, and the ones that you slipped go over that last one, and then the last one you knit. And then on the way back, row number 12, is going to be pass one and then purl the whole row. So this is a very pretty stitch. I think I'm going to make some pillows, some cushions for my couch, cover them. Because this is really, really pretty stitch. So maybe a vest, if you can make a vest with this stitch, wouldn't that be pretty? So, thank you very much for watching. Please share us with your friends and like our page and subscribe. And let me show you how this looks. So, this is so pretty. See? So, let me get it a little bit far. So, I'll take some pictures. Thank you very much.